Hello friends, in this video we are going to see exposed drop down menu in MDC material design component in Android. Normally what we do that uh, if we find any new component then we try to find the name of it and experiment it. So I did it and I tried to share with you. So you can also implement spinner, autocomplete text view, expandable list view, searchable spinner or text input layout with spinner in Android Studio 4.1 by this practical I think that. Let's see the final output of this final practical. You can find these types of drop down with searchable things. Also you can search this one or you can select this one. If you backspace and relevant item is there then you can find from the list and you can select it. So this is the practical of exposed drop down menu. So this will be the final output of our practical and let's move ahead. So quick knowledge of MDC, it is material design component, which is right now it is ready available with Android Studio 4.1 in default project. So one other necessary thing is compile your SDK with Android 10 or 29 or higher. So compile SDK is 29 or higher and upgrade your Android Studio to 4.1, the latest one, whatever the available. And after that, let's start our exposed drop down menu in MDC. So go to new project with empty activity in Android Studio 4.1. This one is OTS means one time step. Now currently it is by default 1.2.1 material library is there. If there is no then write in if it is not included. Uh, right now by default it is material component theme is also set. So no need to set right now. So step is optional. So step number one design your screen with constraint layout, one text input layout and one auto complete text view. Likewise, this one you can see and write your code inside main activity with find view by ids, array list and initialize that with uh, seasons and initialize the array adapter and set the adapter to auto complete text view. This one is the threshold means how many characters we want to set likewise by default it is two just I make it one. So if you press one character then you can check it out. So step number one and two practically we are going to see um, on the Android Studio 4.1. So go to Android Studio and uh, go to file new and uh, new project with empty activity project. Give the name whatever the name you want to give. Likewise uh, right now I want to give the name demo underscore exposed drop down and click on finish. After the completion of this finish then uh, first we are going to design our screen. So design our screen just I want to set first uh, make the padding of uh, 20 dp I think and uh, it's okay and replace this text view with text input layout. Okay, so by default com dot google dot android dot material dot these text input layout you can find layout with uh, match parent and uh, remove this text what are the text you have set I also don't want bottom to bottom off just I want to set the padding over here so just type press set okay slash ending tag with this one and um, inside this set one attribute padding equals to whatever the okay margin I want to set margin top okay 20 dp it's okay from the top of the position and style mind well this one is the totally important about the style so set the style to this one ended dot there are many styles are given in the list just I set uh, exposed drop down menu. So you can see this style over here. So exposed drop down menu. So set the style by this way and inside that just uh, one more thing we need to do it is uh, we try to set certain things but uh, mind well that over here one asset we want to set on the left side. So go to new and vector asset just I want to set one icon on the left side of this exposed drop down. So just I set AC unit click on finish and after that as per the you can set as per your color choice also. So just type start and uh, start drawable we set this one icon 
So start icon drawable we I have set to whatever the selection you can set see on the right side of the screen. So it is for basic it is not basic requirement it is optional thing. So and inside that first we give the ID to this one T I L I want to set text input layout underscore season ok. So already I have set this one and just uh, take auto complete text view inside that width will be match parent height will be wrap content. After that first I give the ID to it at the rate plus ID and just write the ID ACT means auto complete text view underscore seasons ok. Inside that we need to set certain attributes likewise just I set to background equals to at the rate null. So, many times what happened that uh, uh, some default background in some handset we can see. So, you can come overcome with this one situation also you can set hint likewise currently I set season and text size will be 30 sp and just uh, I want to set text style will be bold. So, and let us see another one is margin top 20 dp it is ok and just set padding equals to 20 dp. So, everything I think uh, everything is set right now and uh, TV seasons and uh, TIL season you can mind well what are the remember these two things because we want to set inside main activity. So, go to main activity set uh, step number 2 it is and uh, first we take the attributes text input layout and TIL underscore season press semicolon and auto complete text view then ACT underscore seasons just uh, press semicolon. After that we require a list with a type of string. So, array list and uh, string need to write. So, array list underscore season is the variable name. So, press semicolon and array list and after that array adapter is there array adapter give the name array adapter underscore season press semicolon. We need to initialize before that we need to find view by id write the lines. So, til underscore season equals to text input layout typecast with this one and after that find view by id r dot id dot then til underscore season press semicolon. After that uh, go to for the auto complete text view act seasons equals to auto complete text view find view id r dot id dot then uh, act underscore season is there press semicolon. After these two find view by ids we need to initialize the array list. So, array list seasons equals to new array list and after that we need to add the seasons. So, let us add the seasons array list and dot seasons dot add then uh, first we add the winter and press semicolon. After that the same step uh, we need to repeat whatever the number of element you want to write likewise array list dot add spring array list dot add what are the seasons you want to set summer and uh, I want to add monsoon also. So, whatever the number of variables you need to set inside uh, array list you can set by this way with dot add and string uh, value or string variable. So, it is very easy and nice step. So, I um, remember you to array list is more convenient uh, instead of array. So, string array uh, you if you are using then replace with this array list. So, initialize array adapter equals to new array adapter and get application context r dot layout dot by default this one is given support simple spinner drop down item. So, right now it is by default given this one is and the third argument is array list. So, array list season is the third, gar, third argument and after that we need to set the adapter to ACT. So, our ACT seasons dot set adapter and set the adapter array adapter season and press semicolon ok. After that just we need to set set threshold means by default it is 2 why we need to set threshold in uh, autocomplete text view because uh, how many characters means uh, we want to type and particular suggestions of the spinner 
will be loaded means if i press any single character character then uh, this one um, it is loaded with the suggestions inside the swinger so it is as per your choice just i set one as per my choice so very easy and simple way just i press shift f10 and let's see uh, right now emulator is inside this one inside android studio with new android uh, studio 4.1 so you can also check out that particular practical uh, available in this playlist of this channel how you can set uh, or to avoid the switching between emulator and android studio so our practical is run right now just i press drop down and you can select by this one so monsoon so very easily you can see and uh, write this one so practical is on going way but uh, after this one you can also type like a searchable spinner also but uh, in this practical it is fine with the beginner level but i don't like these small font whatever the available in suggestions so i need to change so for that i need to make it custom so for the custom we need to develop one layout file so go to resn layout and tv entity underscore xml and whatever the values we need to set and we need to update the adapter also so what we do so go to res and uh, layout and inside that right click on it new layout resource file so inside this layout resource file just i have set tv underscore entity and uh, go to code and replace this constraint layout to text view so just i set text view and uh, width is match parent it is okay uh, match parent it is and uh, height will be wrap content so view the id to this text view at the plus id whatever the id you want to set and it is totally optional thing but i uh, try to give the id with this one also so background is at the red or has fff you can set to white what are the choice as per your and uh, padding is equal to 20 dp and uh, another thing i want to set text color equals to black has 0 0 0 rgb and text size will be 30 sp so another thing textile will be bold so everything it is okay and uh, as per our choice we have set all those things inside tv underscore entity underscore xml file so just what exit thing when we need to change it's a array adapters second argument so current right now r dot layout dot support simple spinner drop down item uh, so just i need to change to tv underscore entity so custom base also you can set likewise this one just i press shift f10 and let's see customize auto complete text view likewise this one you can see and right now you can see this one exposed drop down menu so our final output is ready see this one very nice way you can watch out watch it out and uh, if you press s then you can also press spring and summer and uh, o a then whatever the options are available right now winter also so you can set by this way so searchable spinner autocomplete text view or text input layout with drop down all the things practically implemented after this one so i think it will be helpful for you so as per the final output of exposed drop down menu is ready so exposed drop down menu as per the commitment you can see as per the commitment our output is ready so exposed drop down menu in mdc means new material design components library in android studio 4.1 so it is also a solution of text spinner or spinner in material design auto complete text view in mdc expandable list view searchable spinner text input layout with spinner in new style so for more updates regarding android studio 4.1 subscribe and share this channel so completed it might be helpful for you something new to learn then just write in comment so this video is completed it is just an experiment i shared with you so i definitely you like this one thanks for watching subscribe it and like it share with your friends thank you thank you very much